Oh, princess. It's a me, Luigi. Is there anybody else here? Oh. Hey you guys, and welcome to the Jacob Hexa channel. If you're one of my unlucky negative eight returning subscribers, I'm sorry, <laughs> welcome back. Today, we are doing the first video of Witching Me. Today, we're gonna be hopping on the bandwagon of the Bowsette, Super Crown, new Mario stuff, and I'm gonna be doing a Boo Wet makeup tutorial. I thought, though it's not witchy like I like to do normally, it's still kind of spooky and ghostly. I'm really excited to be doing this today. I've been kind of putting it together for like a week and a half now. I even made the costume for whatever reason. I'm just an idiot. And I'm especially looking forward to the people that are going to tell me that I'm white faced. <laughs> looking at you, racist. Anyways, enough chit chat. Without further ado, let's get into it. Alright, so in classic Jacob Hexa fashion, we have blocked our eyebrows off. I did it off camera just because I kind of do it every video and I'm getting sick of it. If you want a full video on that, let me know in the comments below. Alrighty, so first we're going to prime our skin. I go in with the Benefit Professional. Alright, and now we're going to take our face paint of choice. Mine is going to be the Mayron Cream Blend Sticks. And I'm going to use actually two colors. I'm going to use white and I'm going to use this? light gray for contour. Now we're gonna go ahead and blend all this out with a damp beauty sponge. All right, now that we've got a good solid base on, we're gonna use a little bit more white in the highlight areas to make it super opaque. Alrighty, now that we've completely set down our base, we're gonna go ahead and set it with powder. Don't worry about your eyelids, we're gonna actually use an eyelid base later. So just make sure everything else is smooth and blended out and then we'll set it with a translucent powder. I'm personally using the RCMA No Color Powder. Another good powder would probably be the um, NYX HD um, Loose Powder. But just anything that you can really bake your face with because this makeup really needs to be baked because it's a grease paint, pretty much, and a stick. So you just really want to set that into place. Alright, so now for my favorite part, contouring. This is when you start thinking that I actually know how to do makeup in a tutorial. <laughs> We're gonna actually go in with a light gray color to start contouring. Be very careful with this step. When you're working with white to anything else, it can get really muddy really quickly. So just take your time, slowly blend, gradually build color, and then you'll get a seamless blend. All right, you guys, now we're gonna go ahead and contour our nose. Again, be very careful with this step. Nothing's worse than a muddy nose. Mario! 
Alrighty then, here's to another favorite part of mine. We're gonna actually start working on eyes. So, we are going to take it. I use this NYX gel liner. Alright, so now we're gonna go in with the eyeshadow. I'm gonna do something probably a little bit over the top, but it's okay, the character doesn't exist, so I kind of have that creative liberty. We're gonna take the Black Hard Magic color from the Kat Von D and Divine palette. Just kind of pack that in the side here. I'm gonna draw a little bit higher than my crease just because I have hooded eyes. And now I'm going to be bold and go in with a purple color and blend the edges of that hard magic color. I totally forgot to do this, but you might want to just put a little bake underneath your eyes, catch any fallout. A really pigmented shadow will quite literally ruin this entire makeup since it's just white. Alright, now I'm going to take the purple color that we've been making, carry it quite a bit under my eye. And now I'm actually going to put a little bit of pink in there. Now, I'm going to be a basic bitch and go ahead and cut my crease like I pretty much always do. But when it ain't broke, don't fix it. I'm really terrible at filming. <laughs> I did want to blush up a little bit just because the point of the super crown which is where all this medium came from is that you look a little bit like Princess Peach so I'm gonna go ahead and blush up our cheeks just a little tad bit Alright, so now we're going to do one of the scariest parts, and that is brows. So we're going to go ahead in with that same old gray shadow that we've been using this whole time. Going to kind of draw a shape that I like. I'm going to take my flash color palette. We're gonna go in with a precise flat brush. We are going to take that same white cream paint. I'm gonna go ahead and just take a little brush like this and blend out this white cream. All right, so now is the scary time. Again, it's time for liner. This is gonna be really annoying. I'm sorry, I'm literally gonna cover my face, but I will try not to. Okay, that sucks. <laughs> I look really bad, but we can make it better. 
These eyeliner wings are not even distant cousins. They are two best friends that people think look the same but actually look nothing alike. Okay. It's fine. Everything's fine. I'm okay. to tight line our upper water line, it's a really important step. Alright, now we're going to go in with some falsies. I'm going to take these lily lashes. I don't know what style this is, I just kind of found it at TG Maxx for some bucks, so that's that on that. Then I'm going to take my trusty, dusty, duo <laughs> lash glue. Now I'm gonna go ahead and take some of these double up individual lashes from Ardell and place a couple on the bottom. All right, and to finish up highlighting our cheekbones, we're gonna take the Carly Bible palette and we're gonna take that white highlighter. And now we can move on to the final step, and that is lips. Just take a little Wet n Wild eyeshadow brush. I'm gonna dip into my MAC um, lip palette. I'm gonna throw the rest of my costume on, wig and all that, and then I'll be right back. All right, you guys, so this is the final look. I am beyond overjoyed by how this came out. It's literally just how I wanted it to come out. I mean, this literally yesterday, stayed up till 3 a.m. Um, I bought these gloves from Walmart. Um, I didn't actually paint my skin, I just am using a stocking to make it look like my skin. I made this choker as well. I made this crown. If you guys want a super crown tutorial, let me know in the comments down below. I had a lot of fun doing this tutorial. I don't know if you can really even say it was a tutorial because I was all over the place, but nonetheless, I did have a really good time doing this. If you enjoyed it, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. If you want a super crown tutorial, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up and let me know in the comments down below. If you have any other suggestions for videos you'd like to see from me, go ahead and leave a comment. Feel free to connect with me on Instagram or Twitter at Jacob Hexa. You can reach me really quickly through there. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss a moment of this year's Witchy Ween. And make sure that you subscribe so you can see what I have in store for the rest of the year. So that's it for this look. Thank you so much for tuning in. You guys have a great rest of your day and a great witchy ween and Johnny.